Hey, how are you doing? I am Gio. And I'm Myla. It's Myla. And welcome to the channel. If you're new, welcome back. If you're not new, and welcome to another music production. In welcome Myla to Nightwish. So, Myla wanted to do another video with us, me. And I thought, let's let's introduce Myla Nightwish, right? I think that would be appropriate. Um, the obvious one was Ghost Love Score. But she thinks she's heard that. So, so we're going to do a song called The Greatest Show on Earth. What do you think it's about? The Greatest Show on Earth? Yeah, it's, this guy wrote a book about humanity called The Greatest Show on Earth. And it's about how humans are on Earth, evolution, species and all that stuff. I know, I was Willow. Yeah, I told you a little bit, these. Yeah, yeah. Um, my life has got a wide range of musical tastes. She listens to rap music, she likes a bit of pop music. Um, I, she, she's heard Ghost Love Score, but I'm sure she's never actually listened to it. Um, so I'm going to try and like mould her into it. I have listened to it. I'm going to mould her into some decent music. In um, Nightwish, you've got a girl singer. And she's a big, tall, she's like my height. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a girl my height. Yeah, a girl can be any height. Yeah, usually girls are smaller, right? Usually. So apparently, this is an interesting for you, she used to get bullied when she was younger because she was tall. So people used to tease her. So now, when she goes on stage, she puts on heels that make her even taller. Yeah. And she uses like our, um, the thing they used to tease her about is her strength. Now it's like she's like big, tall. Yeah. And she uses that. Because like if you if you take control of someone, nobody can ever hold that against you, right? Yeah. If you own it, maybe you can never teach you about it. So, enough of that. This is The Great Show on Earth. This is the other version. I think this is the one in London. Um, and I like the message of this song. I like what it says. So, me and Mel will go through it in, in later here from. Well, I'll go look at it. So the keyboard player is the guy who writes all the music. Really? Yeah. Who did you think wrote music? What? Who did you think wrote it? I don't know, the singer. Yeah. No, he writes all the music. This is called Symphonic Metal. Do you, hear, you heard a heavy metal? Yeah. This is Symphonic Metal. It's got like him. Violins and stuff like that. Beautiful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You wait for something to happen here. Just enjoy it. What are you waiting for? The one to sing? Twit. It's like, with music you get pressure and release, right? You go wait and as soon as, the longer you wait, the better it is, sort of thing, right? Supposed to be stars in the background because it's the universe and how the universe was created. No one is singing yet. Wait, the like TikTok generation, they've got no patience. Listen to the music, it's beautiful. Yeah, but music that I listen to doesn't take this long to. It's been about a minute. What? It's been about a minute. A minute? Yeah. Why does it take a minute to release 
to represent all the stars in your gosh. All the planets and stars. Hmm? Is a girl a singer? Yeah. Yeah, she's got an amazing voice. Like, amazing voice. No one's here. Oh, it's an empty stage. Yeah, it's, it's down to. Like, he's playing a guitar. The other guy's playing a keyboard. No, but why is an empty stage? Why is no one there? Sweet. Wait. Wait. Um, it looks like she's about to cry. You get your voice to show on the cut, you've got to bring it up to like your um, stomach. You've got to like, use your stomach to push your voice up through your chest. Could we play supports because you need to pause doing that again, right? So four minutes in, what do you think? And then hop then. Uh, yeah, I know. Okay. See, that's the thing, eh? See, like, um, see, if you've got kids, you'll notice this. See, try to sit down and watch a film or anything that's longer than 10 minutes with them. It's a nightmare because their attention spawns have been, like, decimated by TikTok and, and YouTube and stuff like that. Like, if you can get a kid to pay attention for 10 minutes these days, you're doing well. You find out, Luca. Do you think your attention spawned? Do you think you've missed it? Awesome, You think it was okay? No, but no, it's no, it's attention spawned in my list. Um, and in my ten minutes, and they're, they're like sat and fidgeting and stuff like that. So, in my list, obviously got no um, patience. She's expecting the song just to start in. Yeah, because you know, it normally does that. Yeah, it normally does that. But you know, it's a special. This is a, it's a performance, right? So, I, her name's Floor. Floor. Yeah. Imagine naming your kids. Floor. She's from Holland. Imagine naming your kids from Holland. She's from Holland. People in Holland are gone. What do you call your kid Myla? You know? No, but or George. How many Georges do you think there is in, in, in uh, Holland? Name much. Well, no, but why is someone named Floor? Is our brother named Wall? Bad pipes. It's like Scottish bad pipes, except it's out of tracking. Because you don't have to blow into it. See, with bad pipes, you've got to blow. Yeah. With the other pipes, you've got to squeeze a bag with your arm. And then I can't. Yeah. Yeah. That's your hair. After sleeping through a hundred million centuries, we have finally opened our eyes on a sumptuous planet, sparkling with colour, bountiful with life. Within decades, we must close our eyes again. Isn't it a noble and enlightened way of spending our brief time in the sun to work at understanding the universe? So, basically, in one sense, how old is the planet Earth? I don't know, a billion years old? Yeah, like, uh, it's, a, it's, it's a long time. And humans have been around for maybe 200,000 years, right? Mm -hmm. So for the longest time, the planet was... Didn't hit us on it. Mm -hmm. It's like we have opened our eyes into this beautiful green planet, rich with diversity and 
in the wonder or something. Like, you know, and it's nice to understand it and have a look around and enjoy it and you know, appreciate what we've came into. Right. And how we have come to wake up in it. Uh -oh. Luca, you're Luca means so. No. Our brother's name Luca. Luca it means lost universal common ancestor. It means the lost cat. In evolution, like we all come, we come from monkeys and everything evolves over time, right? We've got a common ancestor of monkeys. It's like everything sort of goes back to one species and things just tail off, right? It's evolution, we all turn it into different. Yeah. We end up as humans. Right? Seems familiar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Like, you like it? Yeah, I don't know if I've heard this song or not. I doubt it. The story is that CM, we are one. We are the universe. Well, I've definitely heard about this song, maybe. Yeah, so we are. It doesn't matter what color, what creed, what, you know, what age. Everybody's the same. Like, we're all just on this planet sharing it together. Right? It doesn't matter where you come from. Right? Oh, so I must, I'm the same as an old man. Well, you, it means you've got as much rights as an old man. You've got as much right to be here. You know? You're no better, you're no worse than anybody else. Yeah, I'm better than an old man. You're better than me. I'm an old man. You think you're better than me? I'm better than you and an old man. It's up there so you can hear me.
Every form is beautiful. Everything's beautiful. Everything. What your hard work is, Via Yeah. Yeah, for like three minutes. Yeah. Okay, I'm watching do it for three hours. Like, three minutes is a song, but the whole show is probably about three hours. And every song is pretty much heavy drumming. Right? I never thought of that. Yeah. Our guy's name's Kai, the drummer. Kai. Kai. There is. is. That Kai from the Vampire Diaries. No, it's not Kai from the Devil. It might be. He might be a vampire. That's why he can keep going for three hours. Yeah. She looks like a vampire. She looks like a vampire. Yeah. And here comes the ocean. They're monkeys. Yeah, I monkeys. Before the monkeys, it should say, enter my lap. It's a monkey. Did you tell me how? God of Gods means. No. Yeah, but too. So, when you think about evolution and stuff like that and the way the world was created, mm -hmm. a lot of people, um, things they don't understand, mm -hmm. right? Because you don't understand that you say it was God, right? Mm -hmm. That's why it's called the God of God. We're following the God in our knowledge by saying it's God. That created the world. Yeah. It is God that created yeah, the world. Yeah, like possibly. Yeah. It is. Okay. Do you think it's who else do you think I don't, in the world? I don't know, mate. And can the truth about it is nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody's right. I nobody. know it was God. Okay, it could have been God. Miles Miles is a part of Christian. No I'm not. It was God that made it, bro. Okay, God made it, bro. Then why does God just sit in heaven? What did he do? No, I mean, you know, it probably was. You know, we're just speaking about why it's that lyric, the God of Gops, is if the Gops in our knowledge, like if you decorate with three times three, as you go God. If you don't understand that, yeah, that's a bad example. But if like, we do. So if I didn't know my times tables, I would go to heaven. No, that's not what I said. That's not what I said. So, continue. 
I know three times three is it's nine. Yeah, I know you do. But what I mean is things you don't understand you attribute to something else, right? Because it's like you, like before people knew about the universe and about the atmosphere about gravity, you attribute it to God, right? Why does the sun come up in the morning and go down at night? God did it. Yeah. No. Because we're rotating. So the sun's going around. Yeah, I knew that, but God created the world. He might have. Okay, fine. I'm not going to argue. Theology with a nine-year-old. Un momento. Wow. Is that it? Kinda, just like they do. I like a good bite, I think. But there's an important message. So, first comes to it. Do you understand if you don't stand? But, um, so, you get mankind in. We've got an instinct to get knowledge and understand. Right, and the other instinct is to create weapons in 
to try to rule and to kill and destroy and consume, right? It's like the the duality of man, right? It, like we've got like um, we want to understand and we want to create and also want to destroy and you kill each other. Hi, Bachan. Almost Hi. finished. Because it's not finished yet. Right. It's only like two minutes, right? Do you understand that? Why, like, why, why do we have wars all the time? Why do we create guns? Why do we kill each other? It's weird. It's a strange thing. Yeah, that right. is. We're not. I don't want to die. But, don't worry. Most okay. people are never going to die because they're never going to be born. The potential people who could have been here in my place, but who will in fact never see the light of day, outnumber the sand grains of Sahara. Right, you've known the lesson school of it. So, you can have babies are born. Yeah. Right. So, but you know the odds of you you being born no one told me that you're born because a parrot takes you yeah well but paul says the chances of you being the one that is born is millions to one over the course of a lifetime the chances of you being here is billions to one right the fact that you are sitting here means you're lucky the fact that you're sitting here next to me means you're very lucky <laughs> You, you know what I mean though? Yeah, no, if I had a dad that was like a famous footballer, I'd be lucky. You're lucky. What about you, Tori? We'll be soon. Um, I'm just like, you know, the, the fact that you'll understand this at some point. The fact that you were born makes you lucky. Because there could have been. If you're speaking of footballers, right? There's, mm -hmm. there's better footballers than Messi could have been born in your place, but you were going to sell them. Yeah, I wanted them to be born in this no. place. No, 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 but what I mean is, you are lucky to be here, so enjoy your life, make the most of it, because you're lucky to be here. You won the race to be here against billions and billions of other little potential people, and you were born. So enjoy it and make the most of it, because you're special. All of us are special, because we're here. Certainly those unborn ghosts include greater poets than kids. Scientists greater than Newton. We know this because the set of possible people allowed by our DNA so massively exceeds the set of actual people. In the teeth of these stupefying odds, it is you and I in our ordinariness that are here. We privileged few who won the lottery of birth against all odds. How dare we whine at our inevitable return to the prior state from which the vast majority have never stirred. That's the guy who wrote the book. Thus, 
from the war of nature, from famine and death. The most exalted object which we are capable of conceiving, namely the production of the higher animals, directly follows. There is grandeur in this view of life, with its several powers originally breathed into a few forms or into one. And that whilst this planet has gone cycling on according to the fixed law of gravity, from so simple a beginning, endless forms most beautiful and most wonderful have been and are being evolved. Yeah. I think a logo has the ability to have a lot of. Love is good. Right, it was good. I don't know it. So what's your wind up? So what did you think? It was good. It was good. About too long for you though. Yeah. A little bit too long. Yeah. Because, you know, kids today. Um, so it was us introducing Mail and Nightwish. Um, if you would like Mail to do more videos, like suggest some stuff or listen to it, we'll try and educate her in a proper sort of way, right? None of this, like, um, K pop or Nana got dishes. They're K pop. Kind of. Yeah. But, so we need to we need to help Mail, right? So, um, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing commenting, interacting, everything else. Say hello to Myla, please, because you like, she likes that. You just say, say, say hi, Myla. You want anything to say? It's been one year since I've been in a video. Yeah, it's been a while since Myla's done a video, but I think we're going to do a lot more. If you want to see Myla more videos, you know, as we sort of educate and push her along in the right direction, and um, leave a comment for us in, yeah, always, um, Always Myla's first experience of Nightwish. I'm pretty sure it won't be her last. Thank you for watching and we will catch you on the next one.